know, I sent a postcard to Trisha. You know, me hacking someone's uh, lungs out. Wish you were here. Nothing back. Similar to in Ambulatoria, when the patient arrives I'm sorry, I got carried away. Raise the roof quickly, it's collapsing on my head! Oh no! I'm sorry, I don't dance anymore. I only dance with one woman in my life. I don't want to speak over it. Oh sorry, this is the big part. Beautiful. See, today marks the beginning of a new Dr. Surgeon MD! It's on the floor. It's not 100% why Trisha left. Certainly, our intimate life was not what it used to be after we- Come on, Bob! Uh, rip! I see what you did there. Oh yes, the administrator is known for terrible puns. He's under anesthesia. Now, as we discussed several lectures ago, that does not mean he's unconscious. He is able to feel and think. And if he tried really hard, he probably could communicate through a series of, well, not blinks, but winks anyway. This is why they call it an ICU. Oof. Awry. Now that's funny. Oh, Bob, you look fantastic! Bob, do you want a bitchin' eye patch instead of another one? I see your game. You don't want to go in his head. Trust me, Bob Bob does some good seeing. You'll you'll love it there. I'm not gonna chase you around forever. <laughs> Who are you, my ex-wife? A uh, shish come Bob! Octores. Go lock yourself in the ambulance again. You're funny when you come out of there. I really don't want to talk about it. I just they make me uncomfortable always gnashing and uh, I'm, I'm chewing and I'm, I'm, I'm orthodontist it's like a regular dentist instead of just treating teeth you make them right that's what ortho means in latin right you don't just say oh good enough you say no i'm gonna make your teeth correct the british way you correct things ortho is from greek well thank you large leech hey uh large leech ancient greek is it still a language no. Is British still a language? Yes. Who's the winner now? You have a mustache? You're not Bob. This is a pretender. Someone's trying to get free surgeries out of our single-payer healthcare system. Well, you don't really need the back teeth. Those are for chewing plant matter. And we all know about those. You can just liquefy it and drink it. It's called a smoothie. Invented by a British. The Earl of Smoot. <laughs> Rock pants. I've never understood your name. That wasn't a joke. I've never understood your name. Oh, yes, in Corridoria. I was hoping to not to. Oh, drugged racing down a hallway. Tripping down the halls on balls. Dr. Surgeon in no way condones being on drugs. This is a mistake. Terrible, beautiful, wonderful mistake. There's a mug in him now. Get his mug out of your mug. Ya mug, mook, my big fat hand is in the way. Kidding. They're beautiful, aren't they? We talked about this, I used to be a hand model. Until the foot accident. Ugh. Montreal, they think they do bagels so well. You know what the problem with Montreal bagels is? There's a hole in the middle. They just cover it in sesame seeds to cover up the fact that you're getting 10% less bagel. 10 to 15% by my calculations. Now I'm no mathematician. But I'll be damned if my name isn't Dr. Surgeon MD. I know about cutting holes in things. That's why we don't have a word bagel in British. We just call them what they are. Buns! Three, two, one! I'm just kidding. No, I'm not! Pa! Excellent work. I love you interns. And that's not just the after effects of the drug talking. I feel an emotion called love. And I'm directing it at you. Now, it might be a bit of the drug talking. If it is a male, Homo sapiens sapiens, he has a weak point on his body. Well, he has two, technically. Throat and the perineum. Take, take your hand, make a fist, and then take your other hand and make a fist. And go one, two in those two locations mentioned. That'll disengage him right away.